North Korea's underground nuclear weapon blasts may be accidentally destabilizing a deadly volcano. Mount Paikshu has been known to catastrophically erupt in the past, and according to a new study in scientific reports, powerful tremors produced by these military tests may be waking the sleeping dragon. The world's most secretive state has conducted a series of nuclear tests in the last decade, causing concern in the global community. Although they do not yet have the capability to launch these missiles across international borders, an eruption at Paikchu, which lies on the Chinese-North Korean border, could potentially cause an international disaster. The last test, which was claimed on North Korean television to be a hydrogen bomb detonation although this was refuted by a large number of experts registered as a magnitude 5.1 earthquake. Pressure waves generated by the blast traveled outwards in all directions, including towards the magma source beneath Paikchu 116 kilometers, 72 miles, away. In this new study, a team of South Korean researchers note that these kinds of waves can disturb magma that is already under considerable pressure deep underground. A volcano explosively erupts when the internal pressure of the magma overcomes the confining pressure of the surrounding rock. At this point, the rock cracks and the roof of the chamber collapses, causing a sudden depressurization event and an uprush of magma and gas. Using a series of mathematical models, the researchers calculated that if a more powerful underground nuclear bomb test was conducted, one that would register as a magnitude 7 earthquake, it would cause the internal pressure of the magma chamber to rise. Worryingly, this increase in pressure would be just enough to trigger an eruption.